Okay, so I'm going to show you guys how to make simple syrup um, for the shave ice. So what it needs is you need 10 cups of sugar, um, an ounce of sodium benzoate or benzoate soda, and then a fourth of an ounce of fruit acid, and a one gallon container. So you take the sugar and put that in, and make sure you have a good funnel that makes it flow fast, because I learned that the hard way. <laughs> It's a lot faster if the funnel goes fast. So this is this one had five cups about in it. And then this one has five cups. Okay, then once all that goes down, you can add the fourth of an ounce of fruit acid or citric acid and an ounce of benzoate soda or sodium benzoate. So once that's all added, you go ahead and you put, I put filtered water in. I like to mix it in the one gallon jug because then it's easy to mix the whole gallon at once and it's easy to be able to still shake it. So I don't fill it up all the way. I fill it up to here-ish so that I can still shake it. And the sugar will... So you shake it pretty good and get it mixed up. And if you leave some air in there, then it's easier to shake it. So I shake it a little bit till all the, the big sugar that isn't clumped at the bottom. And then I top it off with water. So it takes 10 cups of sugar, an ounce of sodium benzoate, and a fourth of an ounce of citric acid to make a gallon of simple syrup. So once that's full there, I shake it and then I keep, I keep an eye on it for a minute while I'm doing other things. I usually mix about five, four or five at a time to save time. And then I like to mix it upside down too so that it gets off the bottom there. Okay, so that's how you mix the simple syrup. Then once you have the simple syrup already made, you can take, I, I like to get my flavoring from Southern Snow. You take this flavoring and the, the sodium benzoate and the citric acid, what it does is it preserves it so that it can sit on the shelf longer and won't grow anything in it or, or turn, turn bad. So you take one ounce of concentrate and then you and you put it in a a quart bottle like this and then you fill the rest with simple syrup and then shake it and then you're done. So it's pretty simple to make. Um, if you have any questions just comment below and I'll, I'll be happy to answer them. Thank you.